in a League of Legends video. Today we are talking about Ezreal. So, I got a skin on. Not what he looks like, I'd say. Regular Ezreal looks pretty cool by himself. So, let me just upgrade my Q first. Uh, Mystic Shot. So, it can shoot that far. It's pretty decent. It's not actually that good. So, let me just give me some levels. Um, okay. And if you shoot your Q on someone, it's a good. Um, it's fine. Uh, your Q, W, and R are still shots. Um, so, as you're the pretty good bottom lane champion, he, he, he has a decent range. Um, I say, yeah, he's pretty good. Just trying to kind of stay back a little bit because his range isn't too far. <laughs> but he does have a good mobility ability, so... Yeah, so he can, um, I'll show you that later. But his Q, so he doesn't do that much by itself, but if you shoot his W on a champion, so let me go ahead and, um, get myself some dummies. His auto attack are pretty decent. So, when we shoot the Q, alright, so the Q, it does that much damage. Well, obviously, I'm at level 6 and they're at level 1, so it does a little more damage. I mean, it's a little less, but... You should be able to get the picture. I'm not, I'm just comparing it. So, then I'll wait for that to load up. But when you shoot your W and then your Q, it does more damage. And they're both still shots, so you have to hit both of them. So, yeah, that's interesting. So yeah, if you go W, Q, you can fire them both at the same time. Um, place my W to load up, but you can fire your Q without your W, even. Boom. So like, if you fire at the same time, it will still have that hit on it. Uh, it still do the same amount of damage. So, and you can use your Q to lock it, minions, that. Because it's never used your W and Q on minions. I'm pretty sure your W can... No, it can't. Yeah, your W can, can't get attached to minions. Your W can get attached to turrets, and that will make you do more damage to the turrets. Keep up. Um, so if you shoot your W and then Q on a turret, or W and auto on a turret, it would work. Do more damage, so... That's always something good to think about. Um... But you're, if you shoot your Q of the enemies um, behind the minion wave, so if you're up here and you want to shoot this enemy, but you're behind the minion wave, and you shoot your Q, it'll get, it'll hit the, it'll hit the um, minion. But if you shoot your W, it'll go through the minion. So there you go. And your W doesn't just stay on them forever until you fire your Q. It will only stay for like three more seconds. So you gotta be away. You can't just wait a bunch. You can't just fire W. Just wait a bunch and expect to get that hit again on the champion so as you a good bottom lane champion his e is two dashes um yeah his e does a little dash which that is pretty nice i'd say so there's really nothing much as you doesn't have any great combos except the w q he can use the w and then e will it will make his e better and w then r it will make his r better so now let's go over his R. It or what it looks like. Um, it shoots a big mega laser through land that can that can just go through anything. So if we like, and we can watch it on the map. So let's shoot it up here, and then we can see this little icon on the mini map of my ult going through the map. So for every reason, if you were down here and you wanted to hit someone in the enemy base, you could. I just wouldn't recommend doing it. So yeah, if you can W me. then auto, it'll make your autos better, so that's what I do on turrets. And you can WE, WR, so... Um, I do have a pretty good champion. I'd say he has a lot of skill shots, which are interesting. Ooh, grim, dark future, huh? So, yeah, I like him a lot, he's fun. He does a good amount of damage, and... I'd say you can play around with him, play around with most ADCs. I love ADCs, so I'll be making more ADC videos. So let me just get in the turret, I'll just throw the minions. And then I'll get in the turret boundary, so we'll I, oh, they're just attacking the zombies, so let me... And then they're gonna go in the turret. No. 
and then we shoot the W, and then an auto, and make our auto do more damage. And I wouldn't, the Q goes through tourists, so they can't hit them. So, so hold on, and then I could W, auto, boom. And we're gonna get the turret, because we I don't know why we always build up such a big lane in um, the practice games. We're just gonna do boom, and then auto, boom. Boom, boom. Nothing surprises me. I'm a scientist. Oh my god, I don't know how we build up such a big wave. And we're gonna get more soon. Alright, so yeah, this is, um, as you look pretty fun, and I feel like even though the video is kind of short, this is really all you need to know about him. Um, uh, then let me just go back to shop and show you the items you need to buy, because I always do that. Taking a break, as we And also, if you want to find a good way to learn about, uh, not really learn about them, I mean a little bit, but if you want to find a good way to, um, to like figure out the role, figure out the rune, figure out the item builds, who they're good against, who they're bad against. Um, there is this app. I forget what it's called, but I will like put a link in another video. So, yeah. You could definitely check that out, but definitely still watch videos. And, um, because the videos help you understand what to do. Because if you see their abilities in game, you don't know how to use them. Uh, so... The next thing I buy, the refillable potion, and then I say, go for the, he had a weird item build, I say go for the Trinity Force after that. Makes no sense, but get the build up item, and then you can actually buy it when you, when you uh, let me just, I should give myself gold. There you go, then buy the Trinity Force when you can. <laughs> and then I say get like boots, uh, I'd say probably get boots before Trinity Force, I, I'd go for steel caps, oh, whatever you want. Then I really don't know, you can get this. If you really want expensive thing, you can go for the, that, but I could go for Tiamat sometimes, so. Get that, and then if you really have a lot more, you can go for something like the Hydra. The Revenous Hydra. Um, but I'd say it's not too confusing. Um, yeah, so, as your fun champion. And I hope you like playing with him if you do. And I hope I taught you a good amount in this video and that you learned some because, uh, yeah, I have fun making them. And I will post more ADC videos later. Um, I think this is all for the immediate time because I haven't really played any more ADCs. Um, oh, well, I have been playing support sometimes because I do like that role. So I might make some videos on that, so if you like support or ADC, come to me, because I have a lot of good videos. I have like ton of ADC videos, let me think, I have, I have five ADC videos after I post this one. Danger, so yeah, mystery, yeah, it, it's pretty good, knowledge, I'd say. Just a normal day. I have a lot of videos, and I think you should enjoy them if you like those roles, and just even if you're getting new into League, they would still be good for you. Honestly, so I'd like you to try on the roll and I hope you have a great day and please like and subscribe.